On the 20th of January, historian Matthew Willis and I visited the IWM Duxford's Hurricane Unsung Hero exhibition. We took lots of pictures and visited with the exhibition's curator, IWM's Head of Technological Objects, Rebecca Greenwood-Harding. Now, this gathering of half of the world's airworthy hurricanes was quite something. But the question remains, if we'd been taking photos back in the day, how would they have turned out? Luckily, Matt Willis had brought along just the camera for the job. He had with him a 1958 Keeve 3A 35mm rangefinder camera. Now, the Keeve 3A is based on the 1936 Zeiss Contax 3. He also had a 50mm f.2 Jupiter 8 lens, which again, based on the 1930 Zeiss lens, and also some incredible 80 ISO black and white orthochromatic 35mm film. So the setup was about as close as we could get as people would have used to photograph the hurricanes back in the day. So what follows is a little slideshow of how Hurricane Unsung Hero looks on old school film. American unsung hero runs at the IWM Duxford until the 19th of February. And as you can see, it is a fantastic show and an incredible opportunity to see these incredible aircraft up close and in the same room. And plus, there's two more there than when we saw them, as one was off for maintenance and the Sea Hurricane had not arrived from Shuttleworth. So do get up there, it is well worth your time. And if you pre-book your entry, there's a little box to tick that will get you entered into the draw to win a flight in BE505, the two-seat Hurricane. Terms and conditions apply, so do check those out. Many thanks to Matt Willis for sharing his incredible photos with us. Links to Matt on social media are below. As always, like and subscribe, and do check out our full interview with Rebecca Greenwood-Harding all about the Hurricane Exhibition and also the naughty issues of things like disposal lists. Thanks for watching, and as always, do take care of yourself.